Hey guys, today we're trying Fuga, Melodies of Steel. Does my controller work in this game? Maybe not. Wads does it work in? Controller no worky? No! Shift to confirm. That's weird. Does enter work? Nope. Shift is a weird mapping to do. Something feels metal slug about that. <laughs> Hannah, I'm scared. It's alright, May. Everything will be alright. Ugh, I'm getting dizzy. Get off me, a big baby. I think we may be going too fast. But if we don't hurry, everyone from the village will be taken away. There's so many fucking characters to have. Every line of dialogue was a new person. あがねの爪を Malt, we're almost upon them. All right, with this thing, we might have a chance to get ba them back for sure. Or we'll all die. Whoa! <laughs> oh, that's menacing. A Burman soldier? Wait, 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 wait. wait. <laughs> really? What's with this thing? It's a monster. I... it didn't do anything. I... I think we're okay. This thing's pretty tough. Don't get cocky. If we don't fire back, we're goners. This is bizarre. That's right. We have to fight. If we don't, everyone from the village will be taken away. <laughs> this game just goes. Only the tiniest introduction to what the concept of even what's happening. Just cold open. Or in Meteor S, I guess. Destroy enemies with three gun turrets and the giant tank t Tyrannus. Tyrannosaurus Trex. Children place at a gun turret will attack with their skilled weapon type. They have skilled weapon types? Select grenade launcher. Uh, Hannah, the grenade launcher. That's what she's good at. Alright. Uh. The tank has dog ears! It's adorable little murder machine. And then there's these two. Are the characters always in pairs? It looks like they're in pairs. Yeah, they do seem to be in pairs. Cannon. So everyone specializes in a different weapon. We did it! I hit shift three times. No, six times, I guess. But they gain experience individually? In the results, experience points and items can be obtained. If you're faster, you do better. Ugh. Everybody run! Run! Children are defeating us in war! Aw oh, yeah, had it coming, suckers! Yay! Don't you dare go outside there, you two, it's dangerous. What? They're just kids! We'll deal with them later. Retreat! Retreat! What is... <laughs> what a bizarre opening to a game! What? <laughs> this is the route progression screen. Various effects will occur when turn. <laughs> uh, this is a battle. It's where a battle happens. The number is how many battles. You get health at those places. Like in a roguelike kind of setup thing? So does it just... Shift is advance. Okay. Okay. 
battle start. And Thailand at the top shows actions order, so it's like the, the turn order in like Final Fantasy X. That's their weakness? Its weakness is time? <laughs> oh, it's a, to, the, to the same color. So yellow. I can only pick one weapon anyway, though. For now. Oh, it delays them. So if you hit them with the yellow, then it makes their, atta their attack happen later. If we tag a weapon of the same color as this, the enemy's action order will be delayed. And then you get to do more attacks before they get an attack off. Gyrocopter things! What is happening? Aerial enemies have a high evasion rate. High weapons with high accuracy are effective against these enemies. Switch positions with the Q. Alright. Uh, here you can see the abilities of each children placed in the three gun turrets. I'm already tired of hitting shift my left pinky constantly. It's kind of like the least ideal button to have to press this often. This is information about the top gun turret. The cursor is placed on the attacker position. Weapon attribute effects and damage depend on the ability of the attacker. So let's switch to Hannah, who is currently selected with another child. Okay, so... Firm. Select May. Okay. The machine gun used by May has a high accuracy and is effective against aerial enemies. Now let's sw switch Malt with Kyle. But, oh, so you can pick from, from somebody from any row. What does the back row people do when they're in the back row? Now there are two children with machine guns and one with a grenade launcher. You can only change your formation once every three turns, so you don't do it every turn. So much for your high evasion rate. They're getting rusty barrels. Does that mean they're actually getting out? Just walking over and picking them up? How did they even get out of this thing? I have questions. Alright. <laughs> of course. Repair kit. Alright, so we're all fixed up. Another battle. Prepares vous au. What? It's French. But also Japanese. And then there's Germans. It's like a World War II, but also with the crazy metal slug tank. This is the enemy's armor rank, which depends to represents their defensive power. This enemy has a high armor rank, which makes it difficult to damage, so let's use May's skill. Like piercing shot from the skill command, this lowers the enemy's armor rank by one. You also have piercing shot. How many of you have piercing shot? Flame grenade. That seems like not what we're going for necessarily. Uh, a space is canceled, not escape. Gahoo! Might have been worth it to try to take out another armor. 
Either way, the next person didn't have anti-armor. And by then, enough damage had been done, I thought we were good. Maybe I did a bad job with my C technique. For the first time, I am unasked. I hope Grandma and Grandpa are okay. Don't worry, we'll get to them soon. So what's up with that weird voice on the radio? Who the heck is it? Yeah, I don't know. Who could it be? Hold up. You think we can trust her? I don't know. But whoever she is, she helped us back there. We might have no choice but to trust her. Great, just great. I guess we can't- we ain't got a choice, then. Oh, they're sleeping now? In the middle of the tank mission? Are we now backfilling context once the game got started? <laughs> it had quite the opening. Petite Mona, 12 hours before. Malt. Petite Mona, an ordinary village on the outskirts of the free lands of Gasco. In this little village, we lived simply in quiet peace every day. I took care of moo sheep. <laughs> Looked after me, and my friend Hannah was always with us too. It's an Ed and Eddie situation where there's only children and nobody else. Then there was Big Eater Boron, Brainiac Socks, and Kyle, the transfer student from the city. Our daily lives were always filled with peace. We never thought that would change. Then they changed. One night. Uh. Huh? Why is the radio... Not the evil space dirigible zeppelin saucer dogs. No. How could you? <laughs> oh my god, this character's right. <laughs> our village, our beautiful petite Mona. It's horrible. Ah. Uh, everyone's so old. Hey, you there. Get over here. Don't resist. No. Stop. That rough behave Stop that rough behavior. There is no need to take the lives of civilians. As you well know, his name's Pretzel. <laughs> we have orders to take as many of them alive as possible. <laughs> I guess he said it for me. Damn it. Damn it. That's the worst I can swear as an eight-year-old. <laughs> hmm? Is there something wrong, Colonel? Pretzel. <laughs> no, it's nothing. Once the villages have been taken, proceed with our withdrawal. Yes, sir. <sighs> How shameful. Why did we have to attack such a strategically meaningless village like this? It's almost like we're the Nazis or something. Where are the others? Taken, I bet. By those damn Burman assholes. Impossible. They said the war wouldn't reach remote places like this. Malt, where's Grandma and Grandpa? May. That voice said to hide in the cave? It's in a trap, right? 
I don't know, but let's check it out. They have all their personality types determined by their appearance. There's like a significant amount of designing going- Nope. Oh, this must be it. The cave. But isn't this old forbidden ground? I yes, that is correct. It, it, it must be forbidden for a reason. I'm scared. It's dark. No, I ain't afraid. Okay, let's head in with our eyes peeled. Everybody stick, stick with me, all right? Wait, don't leave me behind. What the heck is this? It, it must be a tank, but I never imagined they were this large. A tank. It's huge. Bigger than the windmill in the village. Hey, looks like we can get in over here. Do you think it's safe? Let's take a look. May, stay with me. Okay. Why does May have a weapon specialty? <laughs> Isn't she? Everyone's a kid, but May is like three. <laughs> this must be the tank's control room. Seriously? Maybe you can rescue everybody with this thing. But there's no handle. How are we supposed to operate it? Not even I know. It seems like it'll fall apart if we touch it wrong. We gotta do something. Aww, I thought we could save everybody. Grandma, Grandpa! <laughs> This is so fucking bizarre, the tone. The characters. Mom. Our village. Please. Please move. It has to be powered by children's dreams. God, please save us. <laughs> Let's go! It, it moved. Now we can save everybody. All right. <laughs> Everyone's just in a pile. And then we even galleoned everyone. The end. Oh, it's exploding again. Ah. Wake up. It's those Burman bastards. They're attacking us. Sorry, guys. Get ready. We need to fight back. Alright, we backfilled the story. The story was exactly what you thought it was. There was an attack on a village and all these kids got a tank somehow. There really wasn't any additional detail that was provided. Uh, it's pretty much what it looked like on the tin. Let's see. Uh, so I could use all three elements right now. I don't know what the back row does, so I'm just going to ignore that. Basically. Yeah. Confirm. Return to battle. Yes. Now everyone has a weakness they can go after. Pew 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 pew. Go, child soldiers! Just like in every animu. But now they're tiny furry baby children soldiers and the tanks have hilarious ears on them. <laughs> oh, it's incredible. The, t the tone of this is so bizarre. It's like, oh no, they're doing war atrocities on us, but everyone's a hilarious animal person in the tanks of ears. <laughs> How are we ever going to save our families from the genocide? Oh no. I, or should I say, oh, whoa, no. <laughs> oh no, is Hitler doing a Jenny Wenny? My brain, I can't, I can't, <laughs> can't do this. <laughs> Look at them go! I got an ass score. Oh, ding! It level. They're even being better at child soldiering. Look at them go! Oh, I'm so proud of them. They're all coming into their own. 
I love their personalities. Leader, girl, gay, fat, nerd, and child child. The childiest of the childs. That's their characters. Now we're looting our countryside. Oh, they've cool, they found a nuke. That'll go well. Yeah, that was pretty exhausting. Yes, having to suddenly fight a tank like this, I'm worried how the others are. Let's go check on him. Intermission. Kind of split between rooms. I didn't realize it until now, but it's really huge inside the the ter the Terranus. You that am I about to manage the Terranus from the inside with a progression system? Because that looked like it was a rendered environment that I'm gonna visit, like the XCOM base. What a marvelous technology to have such facilities to live inside of a tank. Oh my god, yeah, look at this place. This is where you can upgrade the tank and interact with the children. <laughs> As you progress the story, various facilities and functions can be expanded. It totally is an XCOM base inside the tank. I'm gonna explore a bit. By the way, if you get a game over, that means this child died. Okay, but don't go anywhere dangerous. Oh my god. Look at them. I'm a screaming child. Go 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 go. War atrocities and stuff. There was a there was a fishing rod, so I let it drag on the ground and caught some junk. I don't know if it's any, if it's useful, but it's good for taking your mind off things. By scrap fishing, you can obtain various things and stuff. What amazing technology! I can judge it well as a 12 year old. If we have materials, we can enhance the performance of the Terranus more and more! Don't try to edit the tank, child. Oh no. The tank even has a kitchen. With this, we can make meals for everyone. I'm the food guy! That's the joke! Hey, don't eat all the ingredients before we can cook. I'd like to eat an entire pound of raw cinnamon. I'm making meals and stats and ingredients and things. May. May, how is exploring the Terranus? Malt, it's so cool. It's a tank, but it has places to eat and fish. It surprises me so much, I'm kind of tired now. Yep, that's all your tiny, stupid brain can handle. Thanks, May. Because of you, I know more about this place now. Okay. <laughs> I'm having a breakdown. <laughs> I can't believe this game exists. I can't believe it. Alright, alright. We didn't actually do anything. We just learned that there is a base inside the tank. But we're not going to do anything in it yet. Okay. It was an almost tutorial. It was a pre-tutorial. It's a foreshadowing a future tutorial. <laughs> what? You're joking. This tank seems stronger than the than the others. Everybody watch out. <laughs> He's simultaneously so serious and intense looking, and hilarious looking in a way that's very hard to explain. Oh, he's got metal, like, cups around the fronts of his ears, but otherwise the ears stick out normally. He's got the intense, like, like, beard. There's a lot going on with this guy's style. You're already surrounded by our garrison. I do not relish fighting pointlessly, just surrender. This is a battlefield, so I will show you no mercy. Not even children. I am the Nazi. What? 
You abducted our families. You give us no choice. Shall we fight? What are we gonna do? We're gonna shoot it with a tank. It's probably the only thing you do ever, honestly, in this game. I feel like there's one verb here. We will fight you. We'll never get them back if we don't. Yeah, who knows if you can if you can win if not or not if we don't try. Well, what did I expect from children? Such foolishness. I don't know. I don't expect children to pilot a tank and take out my army. To be honest, I don't. You're just rolling with the punches here, buddy. Indeed, that machine is impressive, but you are outmatched. I repeat, surrender now, kids. <laughs> <laughs> if we give up, maybe they'd take us where they're holding everyone, but who's to say we could save them then? Uh, you're probably gonna go on a train, to be honest. I miss Grandma and Grandpa, that's all I can say ever. I'm afraid to fight. I ain't afraid, let's kick their asses. R right. That means we can save everyone. I'll fight too. All right, let's do this. I have no personality because I am the protagonist. I am, the, I am the center of the Venn diagram, of all things. All of I am character character creator default setting man. <laughs> this is war. It's not a place for children to play. Bear, <laughs> Colonel Pretzel. Have you met Colonel Mustard? I feel like you're going to go all together. <laughs> it's not like we want to be here. Very well. Then I suppose you kids will have to face the consequences of your actions. You're the one attacking everything. Ah. Balmung Strike. Oh. That's not good. Why do you still resist? Disarm yourselves and surrender. That was a lot of damage. Hexagons, of course. I'm the oldest, so I have to protect them. I'll do anything for them. Who's going to do it if not me? They're my only friends. I'll do it. If I may be, 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 blah, blah, blah. If I may be of any assistance, then... I'm scared. I'm a baby. The dangerous situation unleashes Tyrannus' hidden power, the soul cannon. It consumes souls. The children die instantly. Do you wish to use it? Can annihilate all enemies with the resolve of a single child. This is some distressing child soldier's magic powers. Will you choose malt? Your choice cannot be changed. Wait. Does it consume their resolve forever? What does that mean? Okay. Does that change the story from that point on? Do they die? Whoa. This is really bad. I have to do something. Malt! Malt, where are you going? Wait, it's playing sad music! Wait! What is what is he about to, Are we about to fire a child out of a cannon? Is this the place? Yeah, it must be. To think something like this was hiding here in this tank that we've known about for five minutes. As long as I can save everyone, I've got nothing to fear. After all, I'm the oldest. What is... What is happening? What is happening? What is, ha what is happening? Help me! What the fuck? Wait! He said it! Loading energy into soul cannon chamber. All crew, brace for shock. Proceeding with soul cannon firing sequence. Auto-targeting mode on. What the heck? 
What's a soul cannon? I, I do not know. Simply do not know. Well, Malt! Malt, where did you go? Don't worry, guys. I I'm sure everything will be okay. I'm not sure if they will be! <laughs> What in the world? Is that a weapon? How inauspicious. I'm gonna, I'm gonna die using my my $10 words. Take cover. All units, full power withdrawal. Full power withdrawal? Firing soul cannon in three seconds. Three, two, one, fire. Oh my God. You, demon. <laughs> He's gone! <laughs> he melted away. <laughs> the fuck? The soul cannon is a powerful weapon that can destroy strong enemies in a single blow, but it has a great cost. It is typically sealed and only be released when the Tenaris itself deems it necessary for use. Hey. What? What was that? Uh, I do not know, but... The light was intense. Hey, check it out, guys. The Burman army's gone. What? We're saved. We're safe now, right? <laughs> this thing's friggin' awesome. Bet with this big old jalo jal jalopy, we can defeat those Burman jerks. Yeah, yeah. Hannah, where's Malt? <laughs> Now that you mention it, he hasn't come back yet. You don't think that attack was his doing, do you? Let's go find him. This is... Malt's hat! Malt? <laughs> I can't fucking believe this game! Holy shit! His hat was here on the ground, but he isn't anywhere. What the heck? They even said with a child's resolve, so they leave it open to they, they leave it vague that it's gonna kill one of them. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> to some extent, like, I get it, like, they're going for, like, a metaphor of, like, they're going for the concept of, like, the cost of war, and, like, the, then, like, how horrible and grim it actually is, and whatnot, and, like, the, what it does to children, and what it does to everyone, and so on. <laughs> they're doing it into such an extreme way, but I just wasn't ready for the cartoon animal people, children, to sacrifice themselves into a gun? <laughs> like... <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> well, this has been Fuga. <laughs> I, well, I'm afraid to see what even else happens in this game. <laughs> see you next time. <laughs>